when the boy ran in. Ms. Leonardo, thank you for being with us. Thank you. Tell me what happened. Oh, it happened very quickly. Um, a young boy covered in, uh, he was very dirty. It looked like dirt at first. Um, he looked very young, very skinny, uh, wearing nothing but men's oversized boxers. Um, and he just first said to me as he approached me, and I couldn't see the rest of him, just uh, the upper part of him. He says, um, help me, they're coming to get me. And then he moved to where now I can see a full view of him, and I see the chain around his right ankle. His feet are very swollen. He's bloody, um, very dirty, uh, terrified, and he just says, help me, they're coming to get me. And I motioned for him to go ahead, and I said, go ahead and go behind the front desk and immediately called 911. Um, but to see him, I, the, the chain really was the chilling part, um, just to see him and, and uh, it was And you it was said his, his feet were swollen? His feet were swollen, yes. To Dr. David Posey joining us out of LA, why were his feet swollen? Probably the, it has to do with emaciation and, and the lack of uh, of adequate food intake. Now, if you decrease the amount of protein and, and you don't have a, a good diet, your, all of your blood chemistry is changed. Uh, low protein fluids will flow from your blood vessels out into the tissues. And that would explain why he had swollen feet. In addition to, we don't know what else he's been subjected to you know, in that uh, environment, in that home, as far as torture and that goes. Back to Le Leonardo, who worked at the sports club. Was the boy hungry or thirsty? Did he ask for anything? He, he didn't ask for anything, but you know, uh, this is, um, everybody reacted very quickly. Uh, one of our sales counselors got him a towel to put over him. He was not wearing very much. He was uh, shaking probably because he was um, terrified and cold. Um, he asked if he could stay close to uh, one of our other front desk person's legs. He said, yes, uh, keep close. And then our district manager went out and got him, uh, took him to the office, and that's where um, somebody gave him a bottle of water. Um, we have a personal trainer, Raylan, that got him a banana. Uh, everyone just started to realize what was going on and he reacted fairly quickly. He drank that bottle of water within probably two minutes with a liter of water. He just was shaking and he says, please hide me, you're coming to get me. I looked for cameras. I, I, I thought some, you know, someone's playing a, a really sick joke.